Good morning, this is your media report for Wednesday, September 17th, 2014. I'm Sergeant Jay Henderson, Media Relations Officer for the St. John Police Force. Going back to yesterday and last night's calls for service, we responded to 103 calls in the last 24 hour period. We wish to hear from anyone that has any information concerning any of our calls or investigations, and we can be reached by telephone at 506-648-3333 at our email police at stjohn.ca, or if you wish to do it anonymously, you can do it through the Provincial Crime Stoppers at 1-800-222-8477 or on their website at crimemb.ca. There's only two items to note from yesterday and last night's calls for service. At 8 a.m. yesterday morning, we took a report of a break and enter at a residence off of Daniels Drive in the Milledgeville area. This break and enter was believed to have happened Monday night into Tuesday morning while the occupants of the home were sleeping. The person or persons responsible entered this house through an unlocked window and once inside, rummaged through several rooms undetected by the sleeping occupants. Taken in this break and enter was a female's wallet which contained identification, credit cards, and a small sum of cash. Members of our forensic unit have processed the scene and are currently working with the investigators assigned to this case. And lastly, to report, at 2.20 yesterday afternoon, we responded to yet another break and enter, this time at a vacant apartment located in the uptown area off of Queen Street. The person or persons responsible entered this apartment by breaking out a basement window and once inside, cut and stole copper plumbing piping and copper electrical wire. The estimated value of the product stolen is around $300, however, the labor of the repairs would be much greater. Our investigation into both of these matters are continuing. And this will end your media report for September 17th. Thank you for partnering with the St. John Police Force. Have a great day and be safe.